So evidently you have an announcement. Yeah, we'll I have get an announcement. It. So yeah. we have a, we are launching the um, Startup Accelerator. Uh, that's it. We in have Warsaw? A, in Warsaw. In Allier, Allier Bank Accelerator. Yeah. We will be, you know, um, looking for the startups that do the open banking to consume our APIs. That's, that's basically That's a good it. announcement though. Yeah, that's just, this is why, you know, I wanted to, you know, to talk about it. Yeah. So we can then pick up this message and share it. We're literally VR. talking about it right now. We're talking about this right now. Oh, really? It's oh, literally that's recording. That's how, dude, just talk. So, so first, what, what's your role at the yeah. bank? So I am the head of fintech. Um, um, I used to be a head of fintech. Yeah, how you doing? Good. I headed up fintech for uh, NTT. We're like brothers, except you got better hair. No, well, <laughs> st still have it, but my, my forehead is migrating north, so. Uh, mine's going north and south. It's, oh. just, it's, a, it's a lot of moose. Oh, yeah. So cool, yeah. So I'm head of fintech. I'm, I'm running this department. So we are uh, working with, um, with fintech companies mostly. Uh, we are analyzing internally what are the key pain points uh, that our business have, yeah. and then we look for uh, look, look for solutions to what is there. Not only not only you know the, the startups, basically you know out, you know whatever is available outside uh, you know our environment, our ecosystem. Now, now focused on the Polish market or broader? No, broader, broader. You know most of our uh, companies that we work with they are in Europe, right? Yeah. Uh, but we also have some partnerships that are outside Europe. Nah, but yeah, we're focused on... And, and what motivated, what actually drove this forward, right? What, what got, got you to the step to say, all right, we're going to step in and do our own? Well, a couple of things. It, it is the bank that uh, was established in 2008 and um, started as a you know, greenfield investment and now grew to one of the biggest Polish, um, uh, Polish banks. Um, and but it's still it's like ten years in the market, but it's still operated as a, as a startup, right? So uh, we congratulations wanna, for that, by the it, way. That's that's a good thing and a bad thing. Yeah, there's you know, challenges. It's a challenge. Um, uh, in our strategy, we want to focus on two things: internal innovation, and external. So when you said that you're doing it both internally and externally, one, where's it? Where's it at? I'm obviously Warsaw. Which part of Warsaw? Just just Warsaw. We have a couple of locations, uh, and we are opening the physical space for startup too. And how many how many startups are you looking to work with? Are, are, do you have a limit? No, I mean in the, in the accelerator we have we want uh, to uh, to have ten around ten uh, startups. That's a good number to start with. Yeah, yeah. But for the first edition, I think it will be yeah. enough. Um, and we are offering a bunch of, uh, of things. First of all, we op uh, offer mentors. Yeah. Uh, we also offer uh, initial funding. The, the mentor side is incredibly important too, I right? Mean, that's the most important part. Because it's, it's right? explaining to them how the bank yeah. and the system actually works. Yeah, you know, if, if you think about how a startup can, you know, integrate with banking ecosystem, it's all about, you know, insider information, right? So if you know, if you have someone that can, you know, drag you through the, all the procurement, all the, you know, processes and get you there, that's, that, that's the biggest uh, value. And right? it gets you past the frustration, right? Because you're, you're not realizing yeah. the, 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 <laughs> the mountain you're about to climb. Right. That's true, um, until you get there, right? Yeah. So. Uh, you know regulations and uh, you know all those uh, other elements are important but really if you have someone that is on your side from the bank yeah. that's the biggest value right so we don't really offer uh, much of funding we have like um, we are offering the 150k police lotus in a form of convertible loan uh, it's not a lot, but for the you know for the early stage companies, it, it, oh, it's yeah. still, it's yeah, still fun, actually, right? You can yeah. you, you can get you from there to to, to the to the. And new they got to learn how to raise money, anyways, because they're going to be doing that for a while. But so. we offer also you know the mentorship. We yeah. offer some kind of um, trainings and, um, uh, and 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 also legal advice and and the physical space to work in. So is, is there a a, an area within the fintech community, uh, especially in, in Poland and, and, and Eastern Europe, um, you know, in the early days of fintech, we'd sit here and we talk about lending, right? We talk about payments, but obviously it's expanded. We got regtech now and suretech. You take your pick. Certain areas that stand out more for the market, or is it just let's tackle everything? <laughs> and everything no, needs help. Uh, it's. I mean, it's, Poland is a tough market. It's big enough uh, to 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 have a success in the in the you know local market. But it's not inter, you know internationally connected because of the regulations, right? right. So, uh, you know, it's sometimes it's better to go to Lithuania or Germany on the pan-European passport, go to the other countries, yeah. right, and and expand your solutions globally. But I think we we have pretty strong talent in Poland, right? So there's a, a lot of companies that have ambitions to uh, to go broad, grow, go internationally. 
Um, so, uh, yeah. What's a, what's a consumer's appetite to, to adopt um, technology solutions? I'm in the U.S. Yeah. We're god awful, yeah. right? I lived in the U.K. Yeah. Much better. So I'm curious, what's it like in Poland? Well, you know, consumers? when you think about Poland, you know, an adoption of the mobile uh, or you know innovative yeah. solutions, it's 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 great. I mean, yeah. you know, yeah. Poland, Spain, and Turkey, they are leading, uh, you know, the, this this race. Um, I don't think people lot. realize that, yeah. right? It really is. Poland is known. For that, for that, yeah, the cashless payments, for example, you know, the Visa or Mastercard, yeah. uh, their solutions were heavily, you know, adopted in Poland, yeah. right? So, um, yeah, and so we think that you know consumers are ready for the new solutions. This is why we're launching this um, accelerator. We want to uh, connect with the best in class startups and the best solutions to offer um, whatever is the best on the market for our clients. So let's do this next year at yeah. Money Twenty Twenty. Let's get a status update. Let's see how that first class that came in did. All right, Deal. and we'll put a marker on it. Deal. Work? Yeah. All right, there you go. And we'll go eat at that restaurant. <laughs>